Welcome to Awakening You channel. If you appreciate what we do, please support us. Thank you. Dear ones. I am Archangel Michael. Ah, we are here again. Ready. Everyone waiting for the new procedures. How wonderful. Once again I want to tell you how wonderful our meeting was, Liv. It went really well. And that will happen from time to time, hey. They're getting ready. We will be together more often, because it is good for you, because I can spend my energy, right away. Very good. Very good. Good. We are starting the third cycle of procedures today. Lots of people are arriving, as always. So, we have to pave the way for them to do it, and balance yourself where you are, because otherwise, it becomes difficult to keep everyone on the same line of evolution, within the procedures. So let's go. For those who are arriving today, for those who want to start the procedures, they will repeat exactly everything we did in the last cycle, which is, the bottle with water, the names in the notebook, the cup in the notebook, and the prayers. No, I won't feel sorry for anyone, you prayed three times, each prayer, right? Then you will have to say each prayer 3x. I'm just going to be a little nicer. I'm not going to require you to say 30 prayers in a single day, because you'll end up sleeping, and you'll end up feeling sick from so much energy. So how are you going to do, 5 prayers twice a day? You will do 5 in the morning, 3 times each, and 5 in the evening, 3 times each, finishing the entire process in 3 days. This way you will be on the same level as everyone who is starting now. You will only begin the procedure that I will go through today, today when the prayers are finished. Please don't do it before. So now, for those who are already in the procedures within the right deadline, hey race the news. If you want to continue with the bottle of water, continue. Anyone who wants to stop, can stop. It's everyone's decision. The notebook, with the glass on top of the notebook, it will continue, why? Because as you remember new people, you put them there. Just remembering, the water in the glass is not meant to be drunk, it's supposed to be above the notebook. As it evaporates, you can fill it with new water, say the prayer. He put someone else in the notebook, say the prayer and keep the notebook there. So let's go to our sixth procedure. As I told you, Let's start moving, let's start learning to live in the fifth dimension, let's start learning to have new habits, to gain new attitudes. It won't be complicated at all. No, you won't have to buy anything for now, for now. Later on I will tell you what you will have to buy. So what will the sixth procedure be? The sixth procedure, you will take a sheet of paper and write everything that you want to happen for good, obviously. Do it. Now, it's important to say the following, it's for you. There's no point in asking, oh, I want my son to go to college. No, it's for you. Let's do things slowly. So today you will write everything you want, for yourself. Ah, I want to get out of the habit of gossiping. I want to give up the smoking habit. Please do not put the word no in every sentence. Remember. The universe does not see the word no. So they won't write, I don't want to smoke anymore. The universe will understand, I want to smoke more. So don't use the word no. I want affirmatives. I want this, I want this, I want this. Always with the word want, because it is a desire. So it's the word want. I so 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 so. Simple, right? Ah, but it will take you a long time to write this. There will be people who will fill sheets and sheets. Excellent. This is wonderful. They sit calmly, so as not to forget anything, and write, they keep writing, everything you want for yourselves. I'm not adding anyone else yet. It's for you. Right? Very good. What are you going to do with this list? Ah. You're going to take an envelope and put this list inside. Ah, but I don't have an envelope at home. 
so don't put it inside the envelope, just fold this list, here we go with the glasses of water again, a glass of water. You will put the list under this glass. Right? Very good. List created, glass of water on top of the list, with or without an envelope, no problem. When you place the glass on the list, you will say the following, May this water bring me everything I want. May the universe bring me everything I want, and may it be for my evolution and my ascension. Why this last sentence? Because not everything you ask for is good for you. Then it may happen that something you ask for does not happen, because that is not good for you. So it won't happen. I suggest that you find a corner at home to put these things that you are going to do, in this sixth procedure, and separate cups, because we will have a lot of them. That's why I asked for the envelope, because you're going to write on top of the envelope, sixth procedure, so there won't be any confusion later. You don't have to open the list to know what is and what isn't. If you don't have an envelope, try to buy it, or do it, or fold the list with a piece of paper on top and write, sixth procedure. Put it there next to the notebook, or near it, or nearby, wherever you want, but I'll warn you you'll have a lot of glasses to place. So if you don't have a lot of glass at home, try buying one, right? Well, this sixth procedure will last seven days, and during the seven days, you will repeat what I said. It is not a prayer. See, you are not praying to me, it is not a prayer, it is a request to the universe, and each person will do theirs, at their own time, and at whatever time they want. You have created the habit of praying, magnificent, perfect. So I'm not going to take that away from you, but prayers now won't be daily, prayers will be weekly. Then you will say the same prayer every day until next week. Then I'll change the prayer, and then you keep that schedule the way you've been doing it. Everything calmer. Right? So the prayer of the week will be as follows, My Archangel Michael. May you illuminate my steps my life, my ideas, my mind, my path, so that I can always realize where I am slipping, and quickly return to the correct path, which will lead me to my ascension. Ready. This is the prayer of the week. On other days this week, until next week, we will talk again about various subjects, but they will not be the subject of prayers. That's over. Now, we will return to the teachings. We still have a lot to talk about. Many things you have to learn. So that's what we'll do. Today I will end here. I'm not going to go on too long, it was just to explain what the procedure and prayer for the week will be like, and you will become more and more ready for everything that is happening. I want to explain a message that I ordered to be posted in the group yesterday. The person speaking here, when opening the messages, started to feel sick. Then many will ask themselves, hey, but the archangel doesn't stay with her all the time, how come she got sick? It's my brothers, you realize that everything depends a lot on your vibration. She wasn't very well yesterday, and when she opened the messages she immediately started to feel sick. But as she is a good student, she immediately called out to me and everything was transmuted. I already told you my brothers, your vibration determines everything. So I asked her to post the message that was posted in the group yesterday. As you grow, you are showing up. Let's put it this way that people are commenting, they are saying prayers. Excellent. This is all wonderful, but not everyone has the heart of light that you have. Then you may ask yourselves, how are we going to know who is and who is not? You won't know, because whoever is, doesn't expose himself, on the contrary, he shows himself as a being of light, as a being amazed by everything, says beautiful things. You will never suspect who you are, or who they are. But they are there, in the middle of the group. So don't try to find out who it is. There's no point in you talking, trying. Ah, let's try to see if we can catch on. No, no, you won't make it, because the person is very smart, people are very smart. The problem is that they release energy, because they are part of the dark. So they throw bad energy into the group. 
So what do you have to do? Observe. When you start opening messages and you feel that something is wrong, close them immediately, call me immediately, that you will be cleansed. Then you may also ask, wow, my archangel, but how do you allow this? Now, my brothers, I don't rule over anyone's head. The group is there, in the world. I can't stop people from coming in. Just you guys have to be careful. Just that. Because those most susceptible will feel it. So, I repeat again, you opened the messages, you felt something strange, you called me immediately, that everything will be cleansed and eliminated. Now, I can't stop them from entering, even because, being part of a large group of light, it can bring them to the light. So it is not our role to segregate those who are not light. Our role is to give them love, is to bring them to our egregore of love. So that's what you have to do. Don't feel angry. You cannot be angry with them, you have to emanate love, always. When you feel, emanate light, emanate love. Who knows, maybe we can bring these brothers to the right side. Who knows. So that's what happened. Regarding what was broken, she put the photo, which I asked to put too. No, it wasn't my energy there, because everything here, in the place where she lives, is already used to my energy. So it doesn't break. There was an attack there. But it was just to show that they couldn't do it, because there I was. When I asked her to light a candle, it wasn't for nothing, I already knew we were going to be attacked. So don't worry, my brothers. We will suffer attacks. I say we will suffer, because I am with you. You are my warriors, you are my group, so it's us. We are together. I can't stop it, because each one of you vibrates in a different way. Now, if you all vibrate light, if you all vibrate love, then there's nothing that can hit them, no way. So, notice that you are vibrating, right? I am Archangel Michael. I'm always here. And everyone who calls me will have me at their side, at the same moment.